Hey y'all, Retromet here. And today, I'm going to show you how to create custom link types in Doors Next Generation. And what I mean by that is how you can have something like track by or affected by here, which these come default out of the system. We can actually create custom things. Um, so in today's example, I'm going to create a custom link that's going to be manufacturing device where I can link to uh, the device that I'm going to be manufacturing these 3D printed components on. And now to do this, we first need to log into Doors Next Generation. And after doing that, hop up to this gear icon in the top right hand corner of the screen. And when you mouse over it, it says administration. Clicking on this drop down menu will reveal a whole uh, bunch of options here. But we want to go into manage project properties. And I'm just going to open this up in a new tab. And hopping over to it, we want to select the links type tab, which is four from the left hand side. If you want to find more information about link types, you can click over on this question mark icon right here, and it also provides you a detailed article about it. But today, I'm just going to go over to the right hand side of the screen and click on add. We then can put in a name, description, a specific link, and we can provide some directional labeling. So let's get started. I'm going to put in manufacturing device. For the description, it's a good idea to fill this out. And for this description, it's going to be the device that I'll be manufacturing on. Now, if we want to do a, uh, a very custom link, we can do that. So here, if we want to really specify, hey, what is the outgoing or what's the ingoing links going to be called, we can do so right here. But I'm just going to uncheck that and leave everything set as default. Finally, I'll click on save. Now, scrolling down the list here, we can see that the manufacturing device, the link that we just created, is available right here. Now, I'm going to hop back over to our module and I'm just going to refresh it real quick. And clicking on this configure page settings button, and I can scroll down to more and underneath the search, I need to search for manufacturing device. And I can click on add. I can either add the outgoing or an ingoing one. So that way we have it right over here. And now mousing over this, we now can add links to this custom thing that we just created. Thank you all for watching. If you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. You can find my contact information in the description below.